Hello friends, Sam Graham doing TCGs yet again. That uh, one case that I opened previously tuckered me out a little bit. So here we are a little bit later. I say a little bit, a different day, which is technically a little bit later. It's later, whether it's a little bit or not, I'll let you be the judge of that. That is somewhat subjective. I am, however, feeling somewhat better. I'm certainly not 100%, but trending goodly. So we will take that, um, take that gladly. Um, but yeah, more Rosita. I haven't completely, uh, I started my cataloging process, I guess is the, the short version. I haven't completed it. I haven't fiddled with, I've done all my, I've done the foils that I've opened thus far. And I have done Majestics. I haven't gone through and double checked commons and rares, but that's just because I know that there are going to be a bazillion of them and I'm going to have them all. Um, so, baby steps. And I've only started the process. I have only done Majestics and Legendaries, foil and non-foil, where relevant, uh, for like starting to get duplicates listed. But since I've been sick and I'm behind, I'm just, uh, I'm kind of, to my own uh, loss, most likely, I am waiting. I, I, I've pulled my inventory down. I pulled it down while I was down sick so that I wouldn't, like I say, I, I ha, I'm all over the place today. I sell extras and stuff to recoup and buy the next set. You know what I mean? Paper shock and Florian. All right, so we got a pretty decent pack one, two majestics. But yeah, so I I do that to uh, recoup. So I've got some of that starting to be listed, but not all. And I've got a cord that is in my way. I'm trying to get it out of it. So yeah, that's where we're at. I've already seen some uh, of the recoup prices go down, but you know, what do you do? There is a art card. Honestly, I don't know why I'm even... I need to check the uh, tokens, but I am past the point of sorting out tokens and... equipment. I have plenty to build my decks with. I've already got the ones set aside that I need for, you know, my personal stuff. So we can save a little bit of time. All right. There is our first cold foil rune hold release. So, all right. Some rune blade hands common right there. Destroy it. Create rune chant. Decent enough sealed card. Not a whole lot of value uh, in constructed, I wouldn't think. Focus. Focus. Yeah, lightning farm. So what kind of case is this be? You got this is this be? Wow. We've seen every kind of case so far, from duds to uh Wildly excellent. What kind do we have here? There's Plow Under. That's a that's a solid majestic. We'll take that. There are a few, it seems, pretty solid majestics. Just glancing at uh, at least what people are considering solid majestics at this point. Just from the glances I've done at. Um, TCG player working on getting that stuff figured out. Um, so that's neat. Uh, uh, Plow Under was actually one of them. Uh, so that's cool. We'll just have to see what other uh, what other goodness we can find. 
Arkin. So we've got three Majestics and a Cold Foil already, still less than halfway through box one. There's Majestic number four, Splatter Skull. I have high hopes for that one in the long run. I don't know why I say that because I don't play Brute and I usually get very cranky with Brutes smacking me with things, but you know, whatever. Just cause it's not for me doesn't mean it can't be for somebody else. Yeah, we're rocking right along. Uh, looked like I had all the common rainbow foils already. Just a handful of rares to find. Um, I need to sort through all my puzzle piece art cards and finish up my puzzles. I should have plenty to do that at this point. Uh, and then still a pretty decent chunk of like bigger foils and stuff like that. So there's still a lot of there's a lot of stuff we're still hunting. And Majestics, for that matter. Um, and then I'll have to sort through all the commons and stuff, which is my favorite part. I say that like a joke. I really do actually enjoy sorting cards. It's one of my... It's one of those calming things that I do. If I'm stressed out, I, I just want to sit down and sort cards for a minute. Okay, and twining. So that's, that's uh, I make a joke, but it's true. Nada. We're still we ha we haven't hit anything since Splatter Skull. We've been uh, we've got a dry spell going here. Really, only a couple more majestics, I suppose, that we would be expecting, because we've already got a cold foil. Um, a rainbow foil majestic. We don't have that yet. So let's see. There's... Oh, cut through the facade. So it, this is my seventh case. This is only the third cut through the facade that I've pulled. So that we've got some pretty wild um, distribution, I would say. So yeah. First cut, or on, just now got a place out of cut through the facade. Better now than never. Strength of four seasons. Probably want to make a total landscape joke, but hey, whatever. Dirge. Not a. All right. We're down to the last five. Like one majestic and a rainbow foil majestic would put us on like strict average. Or we could get one of the majestics that I have not, or majestic legendaries I have not seen yet. That is a rainbow foil lightning greaves. That works just fine as far as I am concerned. Two and a half thumbs up. We'll take it. And we got another art card. So yeah, okay, okay. And there is Seeds of Tumero for our one more Majestic. I, I've seen a lot of, if there's a rainbow foil legendary, sometimes I don't see a rainbow foil majestic. So at this point, uh, that may hold true, and I'm not going to be remotely upset if it does. Last pack of box one, what we got? Are we going to see a rainbow foil majestic? Well, no. We are! Heartbeat a candle hold. Okay. So what's funny is I think I've pulled a couple of rainbow foils of this. I don't... I'm not positive I've pulled a regular one. 
but we will take that as the last pack magic. Let me reset box and I'll be right back with you. Box two, let's do this. Good start. Oh, we did the thing where the equipment's in a different spot again. That's so wild. I've only seen that in uh, the Japanese print so far. It's just kind of funny to me that they're not consistent. Strength of Four Seasons. Rose, I love this Aria art. It's just gorgeous. Like, even cards that you're like, this card might suck. That, card, that art's like, ooh, arc lightning. And unsheathed. There we go. There's my third unsheathed. Where you're like, oh, that's not exciting art. Like, Strength of Four Seasons. It's not exciting. What it is, however, is gorgeous. So, hey -oh, that's more good news. That is my, that's a good pack. Unsheathed and arc lightning. Finally got my play set of Unsheathed. So we're in a we're in a good spot now. Lightning farm. I'm over here. I said I didn't need to do split out tokens, and I keep on doing it just by reflex. Oh well. Rares. Ah. Hey, there we got our Rosetta art card. I've gotten a bunch of those. I have a whole bunch of those. Only one cold foil one. But a lot of the Legler. Which makes a lot of sense when you think about it. The whole, like, cold foils are notably rare bit. Yeah. Y'all know what I mean. Hand behind the pen. Ooh. Earth's Embrace. We like them and just... Oh, and that Vantage Point foil was a rare foil. How about that? All right, all right, all right. So we have our... We have three Majestics and nothing else out of box two thus far. We do have an art card in this pack, so that is exciting. Twining. That's what it is, especially if there's an art card. I take the art card and put it where I keep the art cards at, but then I accidentally still separate the token more than usual, because sometimes I still put the token separate anyway. Y'all don't care about this. This is stuff that does not matter even a little to you. Pop that bubble. Earth that farm. Oh, that was a majestic. Wow. I'm a dope. I just completely skipped. I must still have sick brain going on a little bit because I just cruised right on past. A Machinations of Dominion majestic foil. Whoopsie frickin' doodle. Y'all can't take me anywhere. Condemn. Hocus Pocus. I always think Helter Skelter. I think I said that before. Like Hocus Pocus, Helter Skelter. It could just be my, again, my sickly psychosis. Ha! No, I didn't trick myself that time. Hocus Pocus again. We're just rocking our Hocus Pocus, ain't we? It's kind of wild. This is the best I've felt in days. And yet it's still the most scatterbrained I've been to. Y'all know what you're in for when you deal with my nonsense anyway. <laughs> we do not have a cold foil yet this box. Can't 
count them blessings. Sigil of Conductivity. There's Miss Verdance. One of the delightful art pieces in this set. So we're rocking Majestics pretty hard. That's good news. There's another one. We got Truce. Arcane Cussing. <laughs> Arcane Cussing still cracks me up. That name just amuses me. Because I'm 12. 20 something years ago. Anyway, enough about me being old. Fertile ground and cocaines. I'm looking forward to getting the. I'll probably play against this set before I actually play with any of it. But I'm looking forward to both opportunities, frankly. It just seems interesting. I say that. There will be, probably be some of the stuff that I work into existing decks. But who knows. And if I pull a dang Marvel Verdance, maybe that will force my hand as well. A Marvel Adult Verdance. I did already pull the young one. That was a pleasant surprise. Blast Sigil. So we are still down to the last three packs of box two. And uh, we ain't got a cold foil yet. That's always a scary place to be. You know what? We can also very, very easily make up for that with a cold foil bark skin of the Millennium Tree. A plus. All right, this case, the first two boxes at least are rocking it. I think that's a gorgeous piece of equipment. Like truly just impressive. Especially, like it looks fine in rainbow foil, but in cold foil, it is stunning. All right, all right. So this case, after two, with two legendaries, we are leaning in the really good direction. Open the floodgates. All right, bear with me for a pause while I reset, and we'll get into box three. All right, are we Betty, Betty? ready for box three? Ready. Gosh, Betty. Y'all are losing me. I'm losing y'all. Somebody's losing something. But we've got a really good case so far, so I mean, best I can figure, I'm just gonna suck it up and take it. There's eclectic magnetism, a foil, count them blessings. Which is a rare, so I don't know why I highlighted it, but here we are. We highlighted it, dang it. Dang it. I love you, don't be mad. There's another splatter skull for us, all right. So we're still rocking some uh, Expansion slot Majestics. We love to see it. There are a few of them that I've seen far fewer of than others. So let's see if we can fill out our play sets of those with this case. Still got a few more cases left, so there'll still be a few more videos since I have sworn off uh, opening... Rosetta cases off camera after opening two really good ones off camera. <laughs> but I was sick. I was doing it to cheer myself up. So I guess I, I guess it's fair and it still uh, solved my problem. Because sitting in bed ripping packs open is amazingly... You'd find it shocking... Ooh, there's a cut through the facade. Sweet. Ooh, and a foil seeds. We like this pack a lot. Um, 
it may be surprising. And I don't know if it's just the, the you know, talking, trying to make it more interesting than just looking at packs. Which the packs themselves, I mean, when they bring the heat, they bring the heat. But, um, especially being sick, opening packs sitting in my bed versus opening packs here at the computer was way easier. This takes way more out of me, um, which is just interesting. Exploding. Another thing that I thought was interesting that I just realized, or just remembered, I still, in all these cases, I've only gotten one cold foil of the token weapons. I've gotten, which is fascinating. I've gotten most of the old, the common cold foils though. So we are, we're just kind of slink in the right direction. So this case, uh, or this box, we got a couple good Majestics. We got that Seeds of Tomorrow. So, I mean, we're doing okay. There's a regular Seeds of Tomorrow. Nice. We don't have a Cold Foil. We do have a Rainbow Foil Majestic. So really, the only thing, honestly, we're lacking is a Cold Foil. Slower than the other boxes of the case so far, but... I mean, it's kind of hard not to be after a pair of legendaries to this point. Count your blessings. Felling the crown. There we go. Hey, an Ocilio, a double majestic pack. But felling of the crown seems to be one of the ones that people are liking a lot. Um... So I'm not mad to see that. All right. Honestly, that alone might have bumped this box up into my... Oh, okay. This is actually pretty good uh, tier. And not of there. But still. Yeah, this is definitely trending into our pretty good case territory. Oh, strong yield. Very nice. It's a cotton. I looked at it in for a split second. I think I thought it was, a, it, there was a majestic that I thought it was. And then realized it was a common. Not a. All right. We're not quite to the last quarter of this box yet, but we are approaching. Dirge. And not a pretty solid box, pretty solid case thus far. There's a sigil of ether. Ooh, rot bound carapus is a rare. We are heading the right direction with the uh, collection and the uh, just general cardosity of this whole thing. And another rune hold. Okay, that's funny. Sure. All right. Not what you want to see. However, after the first two boxes, I still can't be too mad at it. Two of the same common cold foil in a case. Not my favorite. Three packs left, looks like. Hand behind the pen, lightning farm. And bloop. All right, are we gonna like last pack or last two packs? Are we gonna see another? Legendary. Is that where we're heading with this? Not in that one. Maybe the last one. Maybe the last one. Box three, last pack magic. <laughs> oh. 
Are you kidding me? Well, okay then. That is, in fact, the third rainbow foil Will of Arcana fabled that I have pulled. So, yes, it did, in fact. Last pack magic in box three. Holy cow. Yeah, so this case, uh, this case is going well, you could say. Now, Will. Box four. End in the same manner. <laughs> Good grief. That's just hilarious. Third. That's the third fabled I pulled. None of them cold foil. I'd like to pull one of those. That'd be neat. Maybe this box. Or first pack, we could get a cold foil blood torn bodice, which is again, it's not a duplicate for the case. So that helps, but it is a duplicate for me personally. So I'd like to see something different. Like one of the tokens. Destructive ether to all right another good we're getting seeing a lot of these uh, Majestic in both the expansions I've seen so many web crawlers. I think I have pulled More web crawlers than every other piece of that equipment suite combined And I, I'm being serious when I say that that's uh, it it may be close and I may be wrong, but it is close enough that that is not a serious amount of exaggeration. If any. All right. Well, so we've are, we're, we're off to a... Uh, couple of majestics start for box four after a pretty spicy wild first three boxes uh but i got distracted i'm easily distractible in this mode people kept trying to take advantage of me when i was like hey i'm sick and they're like oh so this is definitely when i want to make fantasy football trades with you right jerks all right, there's a non-foil heartbeat. Glad to see that. I, I feel like I may have one of these, but I'm glad to see another one. Because we like our play sets and stuff. Especially if I end up being building Verdance. Summer's Fall. Electromagnetic. Splinter that. Starfall. Starfall is the, is the cold foil weapon I pulled. It's the only one. Sorry about my phone buzzing over there. Trailblazing ether. So no cold foil, no rainbow foil majestic. Three majestics, I believe, thus far. Good start. At least a reasonable one. It's not a terrible one. So when I get to the cold foil fabled, It'll be great. Y'all know how I like to be. All right, here's our rainbow foil majestic vaporized shack. Nice to see. I might need that one, I don't remember. The third rainbow foil will of Arcana, that's hilarious. Pop that bubble. There's at least one pitch of pop the bubble and foil that I still need. Hopefully it's red. But yeah, there's just a handful of the rares that I'm still lacking up to the point of this opening. So that's a good spot to be. All right, we're halfway through the box. We got half our Majestics. We got a rainbow foil Majestic. We don't have a cold foil yet. I say half our majestics. Assuming six is the general. The number of the counting shall be six. 
Pop that bubble. Lightning farm. Open them floodgates with a rune chant. Yeah, I'm looking forward to getting some playtime in with this set. Probably getting killed by a hey, arc lightning and lightning farm. Probably getting killed by it since I really like warrior and there's some uh, anti illusionist fun in here too, which are the two CC decks I have built right now. So we'll see how that goes. Strength of the four season. Landscape. Do we get a Marvel in this box? Maybe we get a Marvel in this box. Or a Cold Flow Fable. I already called the Cold Flow Fable, right? Cadaverous Tilling. That, that, that wasn't any of those things. Hand behind the pen. I didn't have any foil hand behind the pen. That was fascinating to me. All right, last five packs of the case. Are we going to have last pack magic again? Because we've hit some pretty crazy last pack magic so far. With a fabled and a bark skin of the Millennium Tree. Save the thought. Sigil. Blossoming nothing. It's actually blossoming decay, not blossoming nothing. Just to avoid confusion. Alright. Pop that bubble. Do that thing. Arcane polarity. Plan for the worst. There we go. I think I still needed one more of these for a play set of it. So that's nice. Yeah, it's wild how some of the expansion slot things I've seen a whole lot more of than others. <laughs> okay, that's legitimately just funny. So we have two rainbow foil lightning greaves out of this case. All right. So three legendaries and a fabled. No marvels. And no cold foil that... Oh, did we... Yeah, we did get a cold foil. That's right. We got the bodice. All right. All right. <laughs> that doesn't suck at all. All right. So in our rainbow foil pile, we've got two pairs of lightning greaves. And a will of arcana fabled. On top of that, we got a cold foil, bark skin of the millennium tree, and a few commons. Uh, between that and thumbing the uh, camera here, and we got some good foils. We got a bunch of good majestic. It's another winner. Love it. This set, I mean, I always get excited about every set. Let's be real. It's flesh and blood. I'm going to be excited. But this set is so much fun to open. I really enjoy it. Um... I'm a fan. Two and a half thumbs up. A plus. Love to see it. Anyway, thank you so much for being here. I really do appreciate y'all as always. Have a great rest of your day. Bye, y'all.